political office holders have been urged to make sacrifices for the future of Nigeria rather than use public office for personal gains. This appeal is being re-echoed by the former governor of Cross River State, Lee Alimoke, at an event to celebrate the life of the late Brigadier General Solomon Giwa Amu, a former aide-de-camp to former President Olusia Gwabasonjo, the former governor who chaired the occasion in Abuja appeals to the audience to take advantage of the gathering to reflect on how they can contribute their quota to nation building. I think it provides us with a good opportunity to continue to share in the discourse about our nation and its future. And so for an event like this, what exactly do we want to take away from here? What are, what are the takeaways? What are the things that we ought to remember? And I, so I came in here and asked, I asked myself, if Solo was alive today, he'd probably be a frustrated Nigerian. He'd be so concerned, so upset, so dejected, because he would have given his all, as he always does. And maybe that all that he would have given may just not have been good enough. This event gives us an opportunity not just to reflect on the life of this great Nigerian, this, this exceptional officer and gentleman, this exceptional patriot. It also gives us an opportunity to really reflect on 10 years since the loss passing.